How's it going guys? It's me Toby Jack here and welcome back to another video. In this video we're going to play some true or false. I saw Jack Jacksepticeye play this and I thought this was a really fun game and I thought I'd play it on my own. And if you haven't seen Jack Jacksepticeye's video I'd highly recommend you go check it out. It's a really really good video. And basically what this game is about you get in a statement and you have to guess if it's correct, if it's true or if it's false. And by the way guys if you want this game you can get it on Steam for completely free. It doesn't cost anything just go on Steam and you can download it. But let's just get right into it. So let's go into the campaign and let's answer some questions. I've already answered some questions just to get a feel of it. But I did see Jack Subtigai play it. So I know what I'm doing. So um, some of the questions I know the answer of, but some I don't. So the first one we have here is Planet of the Apes is based on a true story. Is that true or is that false? I think that's false. So let's go with false and we are correct. That is false. Okay, let's go to the next one. A baby octopus is about the size of of a flea at birth. A baby octopus. Ooh, a flea. A flea is small though. A bit. Octopuses are big. Have you guys seen octopuses? I saw an octopus in the zoo, uh, in like the aquarium once. It's massive. Some of them are so big. So I'm gonna say that's false. Oh my god, that's true. I did not know that. That's interesting. So they're like really small, and then they grow up to be so big. Okay, let's let's go to the next one. The inventor of the pop pop up pop up ad later apologized for creating it. <laughs> the inventor of the pop up ad later apologized for creating it. That has to be true. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, that was way too funny. It had to be true. Uh, let's go to the next one. Sushi means war fish. Um, I mean that maybe they're playing mind games here. That I think that's true, but it could be false because they're trying to play mind games. So I'm gonna go false. Come on. Yes, that's false. See, I knew it because they were trying to play mind games. Because you think that sushi means raw, um, raw uh, fish in Japanese or Korean or something like that, but it doesn't. See, they were playing mind games. I understand you, man. Get wrecked. Okay, next question. The first animal to ask an extent ex extent oh my god, I can't say the word ext uh, the existential question was an African grey parrot. He asked what color he was. False. Oh. Sorry, my computer's making noise. Um, no, that's true. Okay, let's go to the next one. Um, honey bees that return to the hive drunk are punished. So what happens if you come in drunk? You're like, oh, <laughs> you're gonna die. Why did you? Can honey bees even get drunk? How can they eat beer? Like, they're like, oh, I'm high. Um, that has to be true. I'll just go with true. I'm just guessing. I got it right. I'm just guessing at this point. Like, it's just giving me knowledge that I'm never going to need in life. But it's interesting, isn't it? The Leaning Tower of Pizza is the furthest leaning man-made of tower. That has to be false. Yeah, correct. That's false. Because a tower, I've seen towers lean more than the Leaning Tower of Pizza. I think there's one in, like, some country that's, like, really, really bent. But I don't know where it is. I saw it somewhere in a video or something. J.K. Rowling wanted to do a Harry Potter musical. <laughs> Can you imagine that? Be like, hoo hoo hoo, hoo hoo hoo, Harry Potter. <laughs> that would be cool. Um, I'm going to say that's true. That would be interesting. Oh, wrong, that's false. Literally, this is just me guessing. Uh, the original teddy bear was inspired by a cartoon of USA President Theodore Roosevelt. <laughs> Ooh, the original teddy bear. <laughs> I'm gonna say that's true actually come on come on come on yeah that's true get right i'm pretty good at this i'm just guessing i have a 50 percent chance of getting it right so i have to be decent in china john Steinbeck's the grape of wrath is translated as angry berries false come on correct that's false yo yeah. getting all of these right the great wall of china is the only human ma made object visible from the moon false you can't see it from the moon yep correct that is false Yes, I'm just gonna spam through these. There is four. There is a four thousand euro clay table, which is which is a customer's compl complaint. Wait, complaint. Wait, wanting a fund. What? Oh, okay, that's false. I didn't understand the question. Oh, wrong. That's true. So I didn't get the statement at first, and I was like confused. Donald Duck is such an incredibly popular fi figure in sh in Swedish culture that they had to outlaw voting voting for him. What they wanted to vote for Donald Duck? Well, I don't mind. At least he's better than Donald Trump. So true. <laughs> That's actually true. They people in Sweden Sweden wanted to vote for Donald Duck. Okay, I'm done. The world needs help. 
uh, Mark Halberg served 45 days in prison, in jail for attempted murder. I, is that, is, is that not the guy who created Facebook or something? Mark Wahlberg? I don't know. No, no, that's Mark Zuckerberg. He created Facebook. I don't know who Mark Wahlberg is. So, honestly, that's true, I guess. I don't know. Yay, correct, that's true. Okay, let's go to the next one. Penguins are on, only known animals to fly with no one looking. Are only known animal to know fly. What? Okay, that's false. How do you know when no one's looking? Yeah, correct, that's false. So, logic. Only two species have domesticated other species, human and ants. True. Come on. Yep, that's true. Correct, Amondo. Uh, approximately 62% of Americans have less than 1,000 in their saving accounts and 21% don't have a saving account. That has to be true because, you know, a lot of people in America are poor and stuff. They have a high poverty rate or something like that. So, like, not a lot of people make that much money to even have a saving account because they're just, like, barely scraping off. They're barely making enough money to survive. So, I think that's true. And I had, like, America's, yeah, America's just, like, oh, um, kind of poverty-ish. As punishment for mis misbehavior, the thigh, thigh policemen are f forced to wear a Hello Kitty armband. Uh, this can't be true. If this is true, uh, no, no. It's, uh, it's, uh, you have to wear a Hello Kitty armband if you miss, I'm done. Okay, okay, we're moving on, we're moving on, moving on, move on, <laughs> moving on. I'm pressing okay. My game's frozen. Yay. Okay. Vikings believed that a giant goat named Heroin. <laughs> heroin. Uh, heroin. I'm gonna call it heroin. Uh, whose, uh, orders provided an endless supply of beer awaited them in Bala upon their death. So they believed that a giant goat was gonna give them beer when they died. That seems true. That seems believable. That, 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 yeah. See, Vikings are weird, so that seems tr believable to me. Google sent an email to its employees warning that a python was loose in its New York office on April 1st, 20, 2007. It was not a joke. False. Oh my god, we've gone through 51 questions, that's amazing. Um, and not in this video, I think I did 30 questions already, but anyway. Okay, let's get the next one. Polar bear's l l liver has a toxic amount of vitamins vitamin A in it, so consuming it will make you sick or kill you. Polar bears. Polar bears liver has a toxic amount of vitamin A. I don't know, what do polar bears eat? What What do you even get? Like, they eat a lot of fish. I guess I guess fish give a lot of vitamin. I don't know, true? I guess, I don't, why, why am I trying to logic this? It's basically a game of guessing. It's, can you guess the correct answer? That's what this game is. Gamers have collectively spent over 6 billion years playing World of Warcraft, longer than the human species' existence. That has to be true. See? See, video games, people just like play video games for so long. Correct, that's true. Let's go to the next one. Aaron Paul and Brian Craston both got tattoos together when Breaking Bad ended. True. That, that could be true. Yep, that's true. Sorry, guys. Let's go to the next one. Beretta is the oldest gun company in the world, be being established in 1527, 20, 1526 in Brescia, Italy. Ooh, an oldest gun company. That has to be true. 1526, though. That's a long time. Oh, that's true. Okay. That's a long time ago for a gun to be made. The sum of all numbers on a real ruler. The sum of all the numbers on a roulette wheel is 666. Illuminati confirmed. Um, that has to be true. That is true, yeah, see, I told you, roulette wheels are Illuminati. It's controlled by the Illuminati. Um, Al Alabama had re re redefined pi to 3.0 to bring it in line with bi biblical, biblical values. I don't know what that sentence means. Someone, someone changed pi to 3 it went, when it's 3.141. That has to be false. How can you change pi? Yep, see, you can't. Pi is like a rational, I don't know, rational number or something. Tea's consumption rate is higher than all other, all other, other manufactured drinks. All other, other manufactured drinks combined, including chocolate, coffee, alcohol, and soft drink. Do people eat more tea than coffee? Chocolate, I mean, not a lot of people eat chocolate. Like, it's children, and like, children don't even eat that much because obviously their parents, you know, like, adults don't eat that much chocolate. And, but adults consume a lot of tea. If, if children had money, they'd just buy chocolate. 
coffee, alcohol, a lot of people won't drink that because they know how bad it is. And even if they drink it, like, only people with a lot of money will drink it. Soft drinks. I say that's true, actually. Tea is very popular. See, that is true. Okay, let's go to the next one. In Mexico, artists can pay their taxes using artwork that they create. What? Then I want to be an art. I want to be an artist. I'll just be like, oh, you have to pay two thousand pounds in tax. Be like, just bam, the be like, Bleh. that's my art, and draw a circle. I've literally went to a museum where it, where there was a painting of a circle, and then it was valued at like twenty nine million pounds. No joke. That's how that's how good art is in the twenty first century. A piece of circle what is worth twenty nine million pounds. In, okay, that has to be true. Art, that is true. What, you can pay your tax with art that you did. In ancient Rome, a toga was the equivalent, the equivalent to a suit today. Uh, true. Why not? In it. Uh, correct. That is true. Thank you very much. Okay, we've done sixty questions. Let's do one more, and I think I'll wrap up this video. Let's go to the next one. What's the question? Albert Einstein was offered the presidency of Israel but turned it down what he he was offered to be president of israel and he turned it down that does not seem believable to me so i'll say false come on end with a good note come on be right wrong that's true okay guys i think i'm gonna end this video here if you enjoyed this video don't forget to smash that like button and i'll do another one for you guys as soon as possible but guys thanks so much for watching this video and bye bye